Well, I do a lot of videos. I put this head around almost all my videos. I do a lot of videos for the stable, so I figured I'd make some for hoof bid when I was putting our horses in to go. Uh, Beach Bum BB. Uh, did okay at two. Had some put together some decent races. Coming out at three, we had high hopes. This affiliate's never won a race. She's a maiden. First start of the year, second and 52 in a piece, or 53 at uh, Hoosier Park. Next start, she was so-so. Start off of that, she was so-so. Uh, Brandon said she bled, put her on Lazex. Her first start on Lazex wasn't that great. I know a lot of people are going to say, well, they're better their second start. Yeah, well, in between her first start and second came this sale. So Beach Bum BB's up for sale. Uh, when she left here, she wore a 59-inch hobble, no boots whatsoever. Wears a Z-Guide because she can duck her head and she can get a little grabby. Uh, she wore a choke plate, a Z-Guide. Um, I believe a line pole on the left, if I'm not mistaken. But really no issues to speak of. Um, as I, I think I said, a 59 and a half or 60 inch hobble, a long hobble, um, snugger head check, uh, choke plate and a Z guide, but she can leave. She can race from, uh, off the pace as she did when she was second and I think she was second and 52. Uh, she can race from off the pace or on the front decent Philly, but with little places to race her in Indiana left me with little recourse. Uh, when we had this dispersal sale come up, it made sense. It just made sense to put her in it. So all the horses offered, no issues to speak of with any of these horses, uh, and this filly in particular, just needs a spot to race. So if you're close to a B track, she can get her on any size track, uh, and I'm sure she'll do well for anybody that buys her. It's just with yearlings coming in, and uh, it just makes no sense for us to be racing condition claimer types. So offered up for your interest, Beach Bum BB.